We have entered Loki's mountains, Brother Itri. We must be cautious. <gasps> there it is! The great golden boar! Loki's minions may defend it, but it belongs to Freya. Come, we'll race an army and fight to take the beast back. Right. It is said that the gods of Asgard will grant blessings upon any who destroy Loki's temples in these mountains. Is that so? Well, let's try it by leveling that temple over there. All right, this is my favorite mission in this campaign by a mile. And it's actually one of the Our best missions. Our civilization has already advanced to the mythic age. Many technologies are available to us. In general, like it is, it is a really fun mission. Can get a little ah, bit chaotic. Just as I told you, we've been granted great hunt from Odin. <laughs> Anyone can be right once. This is the only mission in this campaign that can't be cheesed, at least to my knowledge. There's only one path to get to uh, this place, and that is through two massive enemy um, bases. So this is uh, you can't really beat it with your starting army. Even if you had to build additional troops, it's very difficult to push through. Um, I'd say nigh impossible. So Odin has blessed us again with the great hunt god power. Means we get a good old macro game for the final mission, and it is fun one anyway. Like you, it's one of the missions you don't really want to skip by doing a cheese, in my opinion. So I'm gonna build a dock here. I mean, as always, we've always got our little chip tips, tricks, and strats. So we're going to be building a um, transport ship, first things first. Start our fish eco. Let's move on to wood production at this point. Yeah, a couple of things you want to do. First off, take out this uh, temple. It's also got an amazing relic. And also, I want to grab one hero. Don't care who. Pop them over there. So we get flaming swords from this temple, and we get another relic over here. He has blessed us with the power of flaming weapons. Just basically here a regen. There's three fishes, so we want to make sure that we're grabbing our uh, farm eco on that. Oh, guys, pick that up, please, and thank you. Literally the whole reason I went there. something. <laughs> We split a temple, but right now we can't afford to, so I'm going to put a couple of troops over here next. Okay, let's actually stop that production. We need to put a house. There's another temple up here we want to take care of. So this, this mission has two enemies. Um, it has... Orange, which is basically a harassment um, faction that just gets on your nerves by sending out periodic units from these temples. And it's worth getting rid of their temples as soon as you possibly can because the attacks just are persistent and annoying to deal with. Plus you get the added benefit of getting um, free... Uh... We have Undermine now. Granted by Heimdall. Yeah, you also get the benefit of having free um, god powers as well from destroying them. Yeah, 
Loki's minions are fighting back! What did you expect, old man? Are you going senile? Probably should have built the wall a little bit quicker, but that's okay. It's not the end of the world. Just get back to farming. Build a wall from there to there. There's nothing more we can do with the transport boat, so I'm going to get rid of that. Start upgrades at this point. Just need to start farm eco. Oh, actually, no, we don't. Not just yet. We can uh, make use of the deer. You guys need to build a temple. Got the watchtower here. I'm also going to build a temple over here too. You see how their attacks just constantly ramp up and uh, get annoying <laughs> to deal with. Let's go ahead. That's the best place then. Put another one over here as well. Should for the most part stop the enemy from uh, being able to just harass us the way they have been. This army should be large enough now to deal with the temple down here. Just want to constantly upgrade the units. Best we can. We have undermined now. Granted by Heimdall. Now we can start on actually attacking the enemy. So the enemy has two bases, very well fortified, here and here. Yes, 
Where's me the dudes? I think there's one there. I kind of want to head towards my next base. I'm short on gold. So gold's going to be the next problem. I think there was a gold thing there. Or well, somewhere around here. If I remember rightly. Bragi has blessed us with the power of flaming weapons. Ah, there's a gold mine there we can utilize. Start my farm eco. Yeah, at this point we can pretty much just put everything on our heroes. I'm maxed out already. He has blessed us with the power of flaming weapons. So we've got three flaming weapons, which is awesome. We'll be making full use of that in a short while. I don't think there's any more. I'm just going to double check. So I could be wrong. But I don't think there's any more uh, temples. Oh, there is one right there. Cool, good to know. I forgot about that one. Use flaming weapons. Yeah, breaking through this is, is definitely one of the harder parts of this mission. Gold is the problem. Let's get that sorted. We have been blessed with the forest fire god power. Does it really help us? Neither does forest fire. It should be in the back in a good spot. At this point I'm going to build some forward bases as soon as I've got some gold. In fact, let's build a marketplace. Should have done that earlier. Far too many of the other resources. Yo, yo, 
So full of base camp. Building extra settlements also increases our pop limit, so we'll be doing that next. This needs to stop production. Alright, things are looking pretty good. Just gonna deal with this lot in a sec. Our resources are absolutely fine now, they're more balanced. Let's do this production building. get from this one. I generally haven't played this mission too many times so I'm not completely au okay fait with uh, locations and things yet. We have been blessed with the forest fire god power. As far as far as just, I guess you could probably use it over here actually. Maybe that does help. Wow, they smashed that already. To reach the golden boar. Jeez. Best track in the game, the ba the uh, ballad of Ace Le Baron. <laughs> oh man, every time this track comes on, it's like a unexplained urge. <laughs> it's the sign of a great track. And it's that catchy. Really? Something over here. I'm still missing some uh, Loki temples, apparently. Not sure where they are. I'm going to say, one of these guys just have a gander. Actually, not a bad relic. Probably worth picking up. That one's not great. It's possible there's Loki temples beyond this gate. Oh, it's, wow, I was not expecting an actual settlement there. Ah. Oh well. Waste my time with that wall. Oh, a Nidhogg. Oh, 
You want to go in the flaming weapons thing for uh, that? We have been blessed with the forest fire god power. Okay, that's all of Doki's temples. Good to know. Don't really have a good way of taking this guy down until my uh, reinforcements arrive. Ouch. I've got too many heroes, that's my thing. Let's get these axe to do with this. Ouch. <laughs> Nidhogs are indeed powerful. So much gold, holy moly, 12 and a half G's. Nice. Should really close this mission out now, pretty straightforwardly. See, I could have pushed in and probably ended it with that last thing, but having Nidhogg just attack me constantly. There's a good chance Brock and Eatree would have died. Better to just deal with him. Uh, hence the forest fire, I presume. I'm assuming there's probably another path, but... Or as far as seems to work quite nicely. Just got a base up there, that's probably where that's come from. I'm just going to push for the win now though. Oh, way too many civilians. Let's kill these off. Something. Make a bigger army. I'm defend my base. <laughs> yeah, forest fire seems definitely is the uh, most pointless of all the uh, god powers you get given. I think one to clear that path is pretty much all you need, as far as I'm concerned. That, my friends, is all she wrote. GG's. And so Brock and Eitri recovered their magnificent beast and offered it to Freya, who was quite pleased with the brother's invention. Loki the trickster was beaten. Years later, the dwarves would cross his path again. But that's a tale for another day.
We all know how that panned out. With our Cantus. Cheeky little prequel campaign, that one. Um, I say there's only four missions, so ni nice and straightforward, but uh, kind of wish there was a more involved campaign, but it is what it is. Um, so that'll run about do it for the campaigns for Age of Mythology Retold. Um, naturally, when the um, DLCs and future campaigns land, I will most certainly be covering that on this channel. So um, do feel free to subscribe if you want to stay on top of that content. Um, that will right about do it for this video and indeed the series. There is only one myth battle um, currently um, at time of recording. Um, so I will be covering that um, and that will be my final video on Age of Mythology retold most likely, at least until future DLCs and additional content get released. Um, as I said, this will right about do it for this video and indeed the series. If you did enjoy the video, please do give it a thumbs up. If this is the kind of content you enjoy, then please do consider subscribing to the channel. It does help support the channel and would be greatly appreciated. Do let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And as always, I shall see you in the next video.